Hello everyone, my name is Wing Blade and welcome back to more Transformers Revenge of the Fallen for the Xbox 360. Last time we played as Stealth Bumblebee and we restored the communications in, in Shanghai construction site. Eight, and in this part, we're going to be doing this mission. Long haul lives. Search signal, I mean, search Shanghai for all remaining Decepticons and destroy them. So pretty much, we can play as Breakaway, Ironhide. Now Jazz is also a character you could also play, but I'm not going to be playing as him for this part. Uh, Bumblebee, I've already played as Stealth Bumblebee in the previous one. I'll play as Bumblebee in the next level. Well, nah, who knows. But for this part, I'm gonna be playing as Ratchet. I'll be playing as Generation 1 Ratchet sometime later. Not later. So, but I will promise to show off every character. So anyway, let's go as the Dockbot. The Decepticons have not left Shanghai. Find and eliminate all who remain. Now, if you want to know who Long Haul is, our enemies are close. He's a Constructicon. Scout and engage. Target acquired. You're taking damage. Plus, Long Haul does lots of damage, so I think it would be wise to use a medical. He's a box that can heal. Now these enemies, they change form. They like to drive around the lawns. When they're low on health, they drive away trying to not get killed. Assault rifle for to do less damage and use the grenade launcher when you've got space. That's what I recommend doing. Decepticons in range. That's how it's gonna be. There we go. But our hunt is not yet over. And so yeah. So pretty much if you die, they'll say mission failed. You thought this would be easy. So yeah. Pretty much. More Decepticons. Alright. Only six more cons left. And then after that. At you'll, ne you'll learn why they called this mission. Long Haul Live. Now normally I don't like doing this. There we go. That's better. I only did that so I could, you know, get the healing. Because it says to unlock all Autobots, you need to heal yourself as Ratchets. To More Decepticons. And heal a lot of damage. Don't let up. 
All right, all the Decepticons eliminated. But wait for it. Stay alert. The Constructicon Long Haul has been tasked with your destruction. All right, looks like our third boss, Long Haul. Long Haul is a member of the Constructicon. It's a shame you don't play as all the Constructicons, because he's the only guy a you play as. He's the only Constructicon you play as. Your attack has damaged him. Apparently he'll try. He likes to attack long range. What I like doing is this. Yeah. Long all prefers prefers to attack like that. There you are. Now long hole likes to fire long distance. Energy supply has dropped to 50%. Anyway, here we go. Congratulations, you have unlocked all locked Autobots in the East Coast by completing res Ratchet Rescue. So yeah. Whoa! Yeah. So yeah, long hole likes to attack long. Range. So give it to him. But most of all, he doesn't want to get himself killed. Now if you now if you don't find the target so soon, then you pretty much he is vulnerable. Now end this fight. So yeah. Just a few more hits and long hole is done. And nah crud, I forgot. Forgot about the timer. And there we go. Long haul once defeated. You have proven your worth. Still. We did good, but our time was lacking and we only completed one objective as well as we did collateral damage seriously to avoid getting collateral damage you try not to use explosives too much our enemies continue to fall first sideways then demolisher now long haul Without Megatron, they are nothing. And yet, their attacks persist. The Decepticons aren't stupid. They must have some reason to hope. You overestimate them. Despite our success, I am concerned that we are causing too much harm to the humans. But Prime, our mission is what's critical. And so is protecting human life, old friend. Get out there and make me proud. So yeah, that's one thing about being an Autobot. An Autobot doesn't do damage. So pretty much, now we can access any character in any of these three zones, except Cairo. Oh, because we need to fly for 3.5 kilometers with powered up Optimus Prime. And score 10 kills by using Ironhide's turret to unlock Generation 1 Ironhide. So yeah, this is by far the first mission that we've gotten the silver on. So yeah, pretty much. So anyway, thanks for watching this video. Be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to see more. So anyway, thanks for watching. My name is Wingblade, and I will see you guys next time.